Good morning chess players. This year, after the end of third round of daily chess championship, I decided to prepare video in a vertical format for the first time. I saw on chess.com forum and an interesting discussion, phone versus PC. And when it comes to chess as fast as blitz or ballet, here opinions were divided. There was often an argument that it's easier to lose on time on a mobile phone. However, in the case of daily chess, everyone agreed that it was much more convenient to use phone for this. I personally play all games through the application on my phone. Of course, I can imagine playing ballets or laptop, but turning on the computer to make few moves per day in daily chess seems completely pointless to me. In addition, in daily chess, you get various types of notifications on your phone, which help you to control your games. That's why I created the video report from the third round of the championship in a format convenient for phones. So the same as uh, shorts on YouTube. It's a combination of 10 short movies, each of which is a separate chess puzzle taken from my games played in the third round of this year's edition. At the beginning of each puzzle, you will have enough time to pause this video just to find a solution. Of course, you can think as long as you need. Then, after resuming the video, you will be able to check if your solution is correct. So, let's focus on the chessboard. Black to move, how to win. Rook sacrifice is winning. Now queen exchange. Check. King f2. And now it's important not to capture this pawn because rook d3 and this pawn is lost. But king f7. And now if we capture this pawn, we can protect bishop with King, my opponent will check. King e3, bishop d5, and bishop c6. Four pawns cannot be stopped. My opponent resigned. Black to move, how to win. I was convenient that knight has to return to a6, but h3 is winning with simple treat with promotion and this knight is overloaded so the only move is taking this pawn and now queen e4 so bishop f3 now the final move knight a2 check the only move is queen a2 and checkmate. White to move, how to win. In the next move, black is going to withdraw queen to save d6, d7 or f8. So rook c5 is winning if b5, knight c2. Capturing queen. The other option is queen before, but now queen c1 and black cannot prevent a3 also capturing the queen. So probably the best option is b6. Now knight c2 capture, capture, and white is winning queen for rook and knight. White to move, how to win. The position is complex and knight sacrifice is winning. Rook f4, rook f4, and now instead of capturing this rook, queen h6. And black rook cannot leave f5 because of simple checkmate. Okay, so 
f2 go to f5 with rook g4 rook f2 bishop e3 and the last free square f3 and now check check and we are taking back this rook winning the game why to move find the best line you probably think knight b7 is an answer because queen b7 a5 and this knight has no full square and it's capture but instead of queen b7 black has a5 and now this knight has no full square in this capture so probably knight d6 ed6 is the only option so in such way we replace this active active uh, knight for passive black bishop so during the game i played queen d2 the lazy positional move and i think it is the best option for white why to move how to win queen e6 is winning take take and now after king e6 f7 with promotion after king e8 check and also promotion so the only move is king f8 but now silent rook d1 attacking pawn d6 so rook b6 to protect it and final bishop e5 with treat bishop d6 so after take there is nice checkmate find the best move for white it's typical trap in c6 d5 e6 f5 stonewall structure c takes d5 it works only when f5 is not protected so the only move is c5 attacking bishop now we are attacking rook bishop a6 and now of course it's not possible to take this rook because we are losing queen that's why i take e6 pawn then and soon another pawn and one easy black to move how to win f3 is an answer you want to checkmate white king that's why white protect now check king g3 g4 and once again you want to checkmate this king so queen f1 bishop h6 similar treat on e4 so knight e2 is the only move and now knight g6 and white cannot prevent bishop f4 and after rook h1 check and nice checkmate black to move how to win here the main question is if black can capture this knight so let's try but white has queen d5 attacking rook this rook cannot escape and it's unprotected but black black has queen b6 and after queen a8 bishop b7 attacking queen winning this queen and winning game white to move how to win knight d5 is winning now black has three possibilities after queen b5 and queen exchange we are winning this knight 
that's why my opponent chose queen e6 then i attacked queen exchange knight and after bishop c5 attacking queen and rook my opponent resigned that's all the puzzles i hope you managed to solve most of them in the end despite losing one game and two draws i managed to advance to the next fourth round of the championship with 20 points this is the final tape of my group and this is me in first place goodbye